Hi guys, it's Monday, and for this week, I kind of blended the challenge and vlog this week. I hope that's okay. Um, we're just going to say it's the vlog with some fireworks mixed in, because I didn't set off my own fireworks. Beck and I went to go see the fireworks here, um, which I set off every year over downtown. So, I'm just going to talk about my candy day that I had yesterday and show you guys the fireworks that we went to. So, um, Beck and I were originally planning yesterday to go to a really popular spot to watch the fireworks here in Calgary called Crescent Hill. We were gonna go there and I thought that I could direct us there properly but turns out I had no idea what I was talking about and pretty much we ended up at our university which is in like the south of the city so I had no idea what I was talking about. But we decided we were gonna go to Princess Island Park instead to watch the fireworks and did you know that a huge Candidate festival happens in Princess Island Park every year because I had no idea that that was like that that went on So that's a thing. Um, we watched the fireworks there. So that was great So I will sh well I will show you the footage of us in Princess Island Park right now Canada, We found our way to Princess Island Park. Hey, thank God and it's busy I know I, I just don't want to like I kind of just my hands are so full there we go ouch and there's like thunder and lightning and earlier people were singing Oh Canada and I tried to show you real quick but she failed. I failed. So yeah, so here we are. So I'll vlog again later. Bye. Canadian geese. They're really mean. Hey. Not for a Canadian, they're really mean. They're super mean. Oh Canada. Look at the moon. Don't worry, guy. <laughs> so as you can see, like I didn't videotape a whole lot of it. But it was a pretty busy place. Everyone was in a great mood because it's Canada Day and we're friendly Canadians. It was great. Um, and then so uh, we waited for a little while. We just hung around there for a while, got a good spot. And then we watched the fireworks go off. So um, I'll show you the fireworks right now. Oh! There we go. Way better than last year. Mm -hmm. The lightning in those clouds is really badass too. Yeah, it is. Yeah, oh, like this side. <laughs> I want people to start singing in Canada. I know. Can we just start it? No. Please? You can start it. I don't want to start it by myself. Please. I'm trying to make some <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh. Oh. Happy birthday, Canada! Our works were pretty awesome. My favorite part was when you could hear the people in the background. Um, singing on Canada. It's a, it's cool when a bunch of people start singing the national anthem all together all at once. What else? Oh yeah, and then after the fireworks, Beck and I planned on going back to her house and I was going to film and show you guys one of our great celebratory, uh, one of our great celebratory drinking games. But unfortunately on the way home we got into a little car accident. No one was hurt. Um, we're both like, Beck and I are both okay. The people in the other car are okay. It was no one's fault. It just was one of the things that just happened. So that was just, we were like, you know what? Let's not push our luck. Let's just go home, watch some Real Housewives of the OC, and go to bed, <laughs> which is exactly what we did. But overall, I had a good Canada Day. I hope you guys all did too. For those of you who are Canadian, even if you're not Canadian, I hope you had a good Canada Day. Um, I hope you guys have all the Americans watching. I hope you have a really good uh, Independence Day slash 4th of July on this upcoming Wednesday. I know that Jill had a good Canada Day, um, and I hope that Brandon and Sasha have a really good 4th of July. So I hope you guys have a really good week, and I will see Becca tomorrow, and the rest of you I will see next week. Okay, bye guys.